Well, Carter sounds like a great guy. He said he's never connected with a woman like he connected with Jennifer. Yeah, absolutely. And, you know, she, he said she laughed at his jokes. And Always they, important. Yeah, absolutely. And they had a great time. So uh, he's now wondering why she's not calling him back. So it sounded like a great date. Yeah, it did. Uh, we actually have her on hold. You've talked to her yep, off air. I have. So let's bring her on. She's agreed to talk to us on the air. Uh, Jennifer. Hey, you guys. Hey, Thank you so much for agreeing to come on with us. I know this is a very big ask, and it's weird and kind of awkward. We want to talk to you about a guy you want to date with, and his name is Carter. Do you remember Carter? Yes, I do. Okay. Let me just tell you what Carter told us, okay? He said you guys met on Hinge. You guys went to BJ's. He said he's really never connected with somebody like he connected with you. Uh, had a great time. Uh, thought you had a lot in common with him. And the bottom line is he really wants to see you again. But he hasn't been able to get a hold of you to set up another date. And I guess uh, you kind of just been blowing him off and, and not responding to him. And he kind of wants to know what's going on. So what's the deal? Because he sounds like a nice guy. He is a nice guy. We really did have a good time. It's just, you know, I guess the sense that he's just moving way too fast. Way faster than I want to go. Okay. Um, what do you mean by that? Well, I mean, not only did he say you know, let's hang out again. That would be one thing. But he already invited me to his Sunday family dinner. Ooh. And I thought that was moving way too fast. I mean, why would I be meeting his family after one date? I mean, it's nice, though. I mean, uh, he must like you a lot to invite you there. Yeah, and every family is different. I mean, I don't know if it's casual or whatever. I think it's nice they get together. But I just think it's a little too early to include me in that. And the other thing is that his mom actually reached out to me on Facebook and sent me a direct message, and I was like, who is this person? So, I mean, they're very nice. I'm glad they get together and everything, but, like, that's just too much too soon. We've only been out once. I mean, several times I could understand, I guess. Yeah. Hold on. Let's back up a little bit. So his mom reached out to you? She did. What'd she oh, say? Oh, man. Just invite me she said that she'd already heard so much about me and wanted me to join their family dinner and i thought wow that's i mean it's really nice but it's too much too soon that's a lot yeah yeah that is a lot again i have to go back to i think that's cool that he thinks so highly of you and but having his mom reach out to you is is a lot after one day okay well i think we both can agree jennifer that he's a nice guy right yeah for sure okay well we actually have him on the phone with us Oh. And that's how we got your number. And I want to give him a chance just to respond to what you had to say because he heard that. Hey, uh, Carter? Yeah. You, is that all true? Uh, your mom reached out and you, you're having her over for family dinner and or inviting her at least? Well, I mean, yeah. I mean, I guess I may have jumped the gun. I just, I don't know. I guess I thought that maybe she was feeling the same way I was feeling. And, you know, after the day and... I, you know, I, I'm close with my mother and my family, and I, I talked to my mother about it the next day, and my mother suggested inviting her over for Sunday, and I didn't really think that, you know, that would be too much too soon. I, I just kind of thought, yeah, that's a great idea because she's awesome, and uh, I, I don't, I, I'm really sorry. I, I didn't, I didn't realize that I was being so, uh, giving you so much pressure. I, I just didn't, I didn't mean to do that. I mean, it was nice of you. I just feel like it's too much too soon. It's, it's, I don't want to move that that fast. It just seemed like, you know, a little overwhelming. I, I totally understand that. And, again, I'm sorry that my mother reached out to you. I, You know, she suggested it, and I, I just – I guess I was kind of just a little starstruck by the whole thing and, and thought that, you know, I don't know. Did, I don't did know you know your mom idea. reached out, Carter? I did know. I mean, I, you know, obviously I gave my mom her name so she could find her. Right. And, uh, you know, my mom said, well, she's not responding to you. Maybe she'll respond to me. I, you know, and I thought, oh, yeah, that's a great idea. I don't, I don't always, you know, think things through, I guess. <laughs> <laughs> that's all right. <sighs> Jennifer, what if you guys did something more casual and maybe we put the whole meet and the family on hold? I mean, if Carter was cool with that, I mean, would you be willing to hang out again? I just, I feel like there are already all these expectations, like maybe, you know, from Carter and his family. I mean, how, how do we move slow when they already know all about me and they're already, like, expecting me to come over and meet them? I mean, could we move slowly? Absolutely. I, I promise you that. Like, you won't even meet my, you don't want to meet my family, you don't have to meet them for a year. Um, well, we I can, guess. We could take a slow, go out, have a drink. Yeah, I mean, yeah. 
I would be down for that as long as we could just, you know, yeah, grab a drink, kind of get to know each other a little bit and and put the rest of it off. I, that would be fine. Hey. All right. Here we go. Uh, I love that idea. Okay, great. So let's do this. We'll set it up for you guys. We'll pay for it. And we want to make sure this is uh, is very casual and no families involved, Carter. And you just get to know right. each other a little bit. Okay. Thank all right. You. Car- Sounds great. Carter, you're cool with all the rules? <laughs> Absolutely. Absolutely. All right. Awesome. Yes. I love it. All Woo! right. We did it. We did it. All right. Very nice. Well, I'm going to put you both on hold. We'll get all your info, and then we'll set you guys up, okay? Okay. Thank okay. you. Yeah, you know what she said, though, was there's already these expectations yep. out there. Yeah, That's going to be tough. It is going to be tough. But he did sound like a great guy. He sounded yeah. like a nice guy, and he's just bragging about this date he went on to his mom. And, you know, his mom, maybe they'll, like, don't you know? Come on, yeah, let's meet her type gang. I mean. <laughs> Got to take it slow. They are going back out again. How do you feel about this? 800-992-1099. 800-992-1099.